crisis as iPod shops for new lawyers as Nnamdekano's trial enter crucial stage. As the trial of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipo Nnamdekano, enters a crucial stage, the umbrella body is seeking to recruit a top legal luminary to replace the current legal team that has been representing the breakaway agitator. Although IPOP has not discarded its current legal team made up of many lawyers, some who are rendering free services based on their belief in the cause that Mazi Namdekanu is leading. IPOP, however, wants the legal team to be spearheaded by a lawyer with high pedigree, generally known and highly respected within the Nigerian judiciary. A top source who is close to the IPOP organization said on Sunday that the current legal team is perceived to be populated by activists who are best suited to work with a legal luminary of not below the rank of a senior advocate of Nigeria, Sam, popularly referred to as Leonard Silk in Nigeria legal parlance. The source who pleaded anonymity because he was not authorized to speak for the organization said IPOP is looking for a highly placed attorney of a son status who is well versed in Nigerian legal system and command respect in the circle. The envisaged son, when engaged, is expected to organize Mazin Namdekano's legal team, mobilize qualified and like minded lawyers to work as coordinated legal team to secure victory over his terrorism and treason felony charges slammed on him by the Nigerian government. As you can see, these are very weighty and serious legal issues that requires a versatile legal representation and not mere activists who many just be more interested in drawing publicity stunts at the expense of the client and we do not want anything that can affect our cause the source said vanguard learned last night that one of the top lawyers being seriously considered by the IPOP leadership to champion the cause of Nambekano is highly respected lawyer Onyechi Ikbiazu, who has a PhD in law and has been recorded outstanding victories for his clients in most of the cases handled by him. It was however learned that Dr. Ikbiazu was not likely going to accept any offer considering the huge implications it might have on his career as a leading international legal practitioner. It was not also clear as at least night if IPOP had even approached Ikbiazu with any offer to represent its leader as the case against Kanu comes up early next year. As to explain the rationale for the hiring of foreign lawyer from the US to represent Kanu in Nigeria, the source expressed reservation over the attempt to bring in a foreign legal practitioner to appear in a Nigerian court, pointing out that it might not work out at the end of the day. My listeners, yes, I agree with you, Nambekanu's trial is having a new shape and um, is becoming more weightier and um, getting more tougher by the day. But then I will tell you clearly that yes, the action the IPOP are taking right now is a good one, I agree.
But then, one need to be very, very careful. More than careful, it's not all about going for a lawyer with PhD. It's not all about going for a lawyer with, with, uh, with a professional um, certificate or a lawyer that is a son. It's not all about that. It's all about professionalism. We have lawyers that are good that have not gotten their PhDs. Look at those lawyers. We have lawyers that have won series of cases, yet they have not gotten their PhD. We have lawyers that are very, very tough in court, yet they have not gotten to the level of a son. You go for these lawyers. Don't just go for a lawyer. Don't. You, you need to be wise while going for law, for a lawyer. We need to be wise. Don't allow yourself to be deceived. Yes, I both have the right to go for a lawyer for their, for their leader. But they need to be careful. More than careful. Extraordinary careful. Because this is a very crucial stage. This is a very tough stage. It demands carefulness. It demands wisdom. We don't just go for any lawyer. You understand? We don't just go for any lawyer. Okay, now, example. I will tell you that the present lawyers of Mazen Namdekanu are very much okay. Why? Because they are the ones that understood Namdekanu down to his hometown. They understand his home. They understand his environment. They understand the system. And mind you, it's not all about going for a foreign lawyer. Does a foreign lawyer understand what is obtainable in Nigeria? Because in law, before you start going for a lawyer, that lawyer needs to understand what is obtainable. Does he understand what is obtainable in Nigeria? Does he understand the Nigerian system? Of government, you understand. He needs to understand that it's not all about going for a lawyer. It's all about going for someone that knows the system, for someone who knows what what it takes. You understand. So all these things are what we should be looking at. All these things are what we should be observing. All these things are what we should take note of. It's not all about going for uh, a touched lawyer. If it is that, we have plenty of them out there who are touched lawyers with packaging, but they are not sound. They are not sound. It's not about being touched. It's not about being sound. Knowing your onion and know how to chew it and slice it. Please, please, and please, IPOP need to be very, very, very careful.